My name is Gugud, a former magician. Today, I am the guardian of time. <laughs> I've already done all the more mundane jobs. <laughs> <clears throat> right. The reason I've come down to Earth for a moment is to tell you the legend of the great knight, Hype. A very long time ago, in the kingdom of Taurus, King Tuscan IV and his queen Lizoth were celebrating the end of the Civil War and had invited everyone to a fabulous banquet. Hype was the champion of the kingdom. And to reward him for his loyal services, Queen Lizoth presented him with the powerful Sword of Peace. This was a great honor, and everyone was delighted, especially his betrothed, Vibe. <laughs> but at the very same moment, a terrible Black Knight appeared. Such a mysterious being had never been seen before. The Black Knight advanced toward the king and demanded the throne. Courageously, at this dramatic moment, Hype stepped forward. But unfortunately, the Black Knight was too strong for him. No one knows how he managed to transform Hype into a statue. Then he cast the statue aside and flung him deep into the past. And guess where the statue of Hype turned up 200 years earlier? In the courtyard of my manor. I was an apprentice magician at the time. <laughs> I was young and inexperienced. <laughs> Hello all, welcome to my next game. We are playing Hype, the Time Quest. Uh, yeah, let's turn on that. Don't think I can change anything to do with the subtitles, what a shame, but that's okay. Let us go, new game. Gagood's Manor. Wretched statue! That's the last time I try to change you into a knight! I know no one can see me, but that's no reason to make fun of me just because I can't do it! Ah, to own a knight! What a wonderful dream! He would pick my herbs, protect my manor, do chores around the house. I must do it. I must! Toritas magia transformare statua in cabalarius servicium. I I remember. I'm hype. I... Uh, I was transformed into a statue by a powerful black knight. He... Uh, he threw me back into the past. Help me, young magician. I... I must return to my own time. I have to protect my... My betrothed, and my king, Taskin the Fourth, 
and take revenge. Uh, take revenge on, on, on. There now, calm yourself, Sir Knight. But did you say Task in the Fourth? But our king's Task in the First. Hmm. Very well. I'll help you. My name is Gogood. But I, uh, I'm still quite inexperienced. I'm not a particularly brilliant magician. I'm worth little more than a melted plastic. But, but the challenge will be exciting. Right. After such a long journey through time, you'll need some training. Come with me and we'll get your coordination back for you. All right. Okay, so with those weird controls, we gotta turn and then you can move. We can move afterwards, but. Oh! Alright. You've been imprisoned in the rock for a long time. It's only natural you're a bit rusty, so let me give you a small reminder. You can do all the actions by pressing the X button. You can also run by maintaining more pressure on the directional buttons or left analog stick, and jump using the circle button. But a great knight really must be a skilled swordsman. To unsheathe or resheathe the sword, use the square button. You can then fight using the X button. If you want to practice hype, try and hit the two targets on this mannequin. All right. Very good. You must also use your crossbow for fighting from a distance. To draw and put away the crossbow, press the square button. You can then take aim with the directional buttons or left analog stick and fire with the X button. To improve your vision, hold the L1 button down. Here are some crossbow bolts. Use them to try and hit the two targets on this mannequin. Then we'll move on to the last mannequin. You know, it's pretty easy for you to walk instead of doing that teleportation thing. You must also master magic spells to undertake such a dangerous mission. If you look carefully, you'll find many magic spells in the kingdom. This is how to use the magic. With a weapon in your hand, choose your magic spell using the triangle button. Then cast the spell by pressing the R1 button. Sir Knight, here is your first spell. I strongly suggest that you practice on this mannequin. It's important to try and hit both targets. You are now the master of the magic focus Magicum Javelin.
Very good. Hype, it's time for you to start your quest. I know that the Royal Jewel allows you to journey through time, but, uh, but I don't know how. You must begin your search for the Royal Jewel in the fortress in the town of Taurus. There are many treasures there. I'll have a look through my old books, and with any luck, I'll discover how the Royal Jewel allows you to journey through time. Come back and see me with the Jewel. I'm sure to have some more information by then. Here's the key to the bridge portal. You can select it in your inventory by pressing the R3 button on the right analog stick. Good luck! You now have the key which opens the gate to Gagood's Manor. Alright. So we head down here then. What's in here? Alright. Maybe I'll be coming back to that at one stage. Do you have to run all the time? You're sprinting, basically. Okay, circles to jump. You collected a blue potion. This potion will help restore, help to restore your health. To use it, you must select it in your inventory. So R three, right? Ah, okay. Magic, potions, keys. All right. You've collected a bag of plastics. The plastic is the unit of currency in the kingdom. All right. It's fairly simple. Key to, to Gagaud's Manor. There we go. I was trying to figure out where, where, why I wouldn't go in. Uh, it's only me again, Sir Knight. Uh, I, uh, I just wanted to offer you some advice. Each time you see a lectern such as this, it means you can save your adventure. Just press the X button when you're near a lectern. A knight who undertakes a quest like yours must be prudent. You must record and save as you progress, so you don't have to start all over again. Good idea. Alright, that saving took longer than normal. Pretty sure I cut that, but anyway, off we go. The Forest, Iren, Era of Tascan the First. Um, sorry, I, uh, I won't bother you again, Knight. I promise, I've, uh, I've got something that might be useful to you. It's a map of the kingdom. You can consult it by pressing the select button. On the map, your symbol shows where you are. The flashing X shows you where you have to go. Anyway, I'll leave you in peace now. Don't forget, you must find the royal jewel in the fortress and then come back and see me. Here's the map, Hype. Good luck. Thank you. Ah, there you go. I'm at, I see the forest. I get to the fortress. Easy. Oh, hello, wolves. Oh, 
Oh, it sends a beam out. Ow. You found a green herb. This herb restores your magic powers. Use it, you must select it in your inventory. Thank you. Alright, what's in here? Hang on, before I go in here, what else is around here? Anything useful? Not that I can see, so we're going through this log. Damn bats. Come here and say that. Ugh, oh, okay. You're a pain in the bum. What's the lectern? Do I need it now? ventures into our forest without our leaves tonight and I don't know whether your gold or your weapons will be enough to pay for your safe passage <laughs> all right R2 and L2 are like dodging sort of or strafing I should say what's in here the forest oh I see Well, that must be the castle over there, so I'm getting close. Oh no! Wow. Okay, I don't know what that is for, but okay. Tonight, I'm Willet, son of the shoemaker in Taurus. We want to make the fastest boots in the whole kingdom. We need knights like you to test them and pay for our research. I'm going to tell you about a race. If you win it, I'll give you a present on behalf of Jamus and son, the shoemakers. And you'll have the honor of having helped us. If you give me a hundred plastics, you can run the race and get our present. Would you like to? No, I don't have enough money. Come back and see me if you change your mind, though, won't you? I'll be here all day. Okay, well, it. Thank you. Do I have to shoot that thing? I can see it in the sky. Haha. <laughs> oh, there's another one.
Very good. Shame I don't have enough uh, ammo for all of them if I end up if I do end up finding all of them. But anyway, let's keep moving forward. What? No. Game over? <laughs> this brings you right to the start. Okay. Well, that was a good intro. Alright. I need to save at every lectern. Good idea. Um, I'm going to end this episode here. Hopefully you enjoyed it, and I shall see you on the next one. So, catch you then.